crested geckos and gargoyle geckos. These aren't your average geckos, they're like living artworks. People adore them for their quirky looks, simple care routines, and compact size. But hey, don't let their similarities fool you. There's a whole world of differences to consider. Let's find out which one can make the best pet gecko. Petopedia Crested geckos and gargoyle geckos are two intriguing members of the gecko family. Crested geckos are known for their unique appearance, featuring a row of fringe crests that adorn both sides of their body from head to tail. These crests come in a variety of colors and patterns, making each individual a work of art. On the other hand, gargoyle geckos stand out with their rough and bumpy skin texture as well as a distinct head shape. Their coloration ranges from natural earthy tones to striking and vibrant hues. Both of these gecko species showcase the incredible diversity that nature has to offer within the gecko world, captivating enthusiasts and researchers alike. When it comes to size, crested geckos and gargoyle geckos have a bit of a difference. Crested geckos are the smaller ones of the two, growing to be around 6 to 8 inches long, tail included, when they're fully grown. Picture a cute little gecko that could easily rest in your hand. On the other hand, gargoyle geckos are a touch larger. When they reach adulthood, they stretch out to about 8 to 10 inches long, counting from their head down to the end of their tail. So if you're leaning towards having a smaller gecko buddy, go for the crested gecko. But if you're up for a slightly bigger gecko companion, the gargoyle gecko might be just the right fit. Imagine crested geckos as the laid-back, calm pets in the gecko gang. They are usually pretty cool with hanging out and being handled, but like anyone, they'd rather not be carried around too much, it can stress them out a bit. Now think of gargoyle geckos as the cautious but friendly members of the gecko crew. They might get a tad more nervous than crested geckos, sort of like that friend who's a bit wary of new things. So while you can totally spend time with both, just remember to be gentle and not bother them too much. Both gecko types are like having these awesome little scaly buddies, so treat them with care and give them some space to be their cool selves. Meet the delightful crested geckos and gargoyle geckos, your ticket to a fuss-free reptile rendezvous. Crested geckos keep it simple with a diet of fruity goodness and the occasional bug nibble. Just pop in some branches in their vertical pad and they're good to climb and chill. Gargoyle geckos, they're like cousins, loving the same vertical crib setup and relishing juicy fruit plants and insects. So get comfy designing a cool home where these charming buddies can hang out and thrive without care. Crested geckos and gargoyle geckos have distinct housing needs. Crested geckos thrive in vertical enclosures with branches for climbing, while gargoyle geckos also require tall terrariums and climbing opportunities. Both need moist substrates like coconut coir and temperatures around 72 to 80 degree Fahrenheit. Crested geckos appreciate humidity of 60 to 80 percent, whereas gargoyle geckos prefer slightly lower levels, around 50 to 70 percent. Gargoyle geckos benefit from low UVB lighting, while crested geckos don't require it. Understanding these differences ensures you create suitable and comfortable homes for these captivating creatures. In terms of health and longevity, crested geckos and gargoyle geckos have some distinctions. Crested geckos are generally robust, but issues like metabolic bone disease and dehydration can arise without proper UVB lighting, calcium, and humidity. Gargoyle geckos share similar concerns. Crested geckos usually live 15 to 20 years with proper care playing a role. Gargoyle geckos have a comparable lifespan. Both species thrive when provided with optimal conditions, diet, and attentive care. When it comes to availability and price, crested geckos are generally more widespread and affordable. They come in a variety of color morphs and are commonly bred in captivity, making them easy to find both online and from local breeders. On the other hand, gargoyle geckos are less commonly available and can be somewhat pricier. 
Their distinct appearance and increasing popularity contribute to their higher cost. So, while crested geckos offer a broader range of options for all budgets, gargoyle geckos offer a more unique and potentially premium choice. Choosing between crested geckos and gargoyle geckos boils down to personal preference. Crested geckos flaunt stylish crests and diverse colors, perfect for those who adore visual variety. Their chill bodies, great if you prefer low-key interactions. On the flip side, gargoyle geckos offer a more textured look with potential patterns appealing to those seeking a unique touch. If you're up for a bug hunting adventure, their insect inclination might be just your style. It's all about what floats your gecko loving boat. So this is all about crested geckos versus gargoyle geckos. Hope you found this video insightful. Let us know what you want us to talk about next in the comment section.